Warning. This show is only for mature audiences who are 13 or older. Your discretion is advised. So I was like, get the hell off me. And then that officer guy came and got her off of me. And then she never came back. Kicking and screaming like a baby. Hey Caillou. Long time no see. Hello. Wait, Bob Krabby. Is that you? Hector. You know these guys. We met each other at the local playground, before we were donated to the JDC. I guess we have something in common stick figure Caillou. I know right. And if you're wondering where I've been, I was grounded for one month for giving me that e-pad. I don't know how my dad found out but who knows. Yeah. My dad is a huge tattletale. He found out but let me keep it during my grounding before I gave it back to you. That's probably how he found out. Oh dear. Well it's fine. It's not your fault but I told you to lay low. I think he saw me through the window of the store he works at. Oh okay but I'm glad we get to see each other again. And I am glad that your talking basketballs met my talking football. Maybe we can do a play date later down the line. I would like that very much. I miss them since my brother Derek died from Poppy69. The si I will allow play dates. Maybe even sleepovers. But as long as nothing happens to Hector cause he's kinda like a pet to my son. So can I trust you Kalu the second? Don't worry Mr. Stick Figure Caillou's dad. I won't let you down. Ah. I'm glad that our kids are having fun. But where is Bob and Hector? Hector and Bob. Be more careful. I'm glad to see Marcus playing and having fun. I can't imagine how sad he felt when he was in JDC seeing him happy is a sign of relief. I can also say the same for Kalu because he is currently banned from the gas station. Glad he can go to the McDonald's that is close to the gas station. Maybe we should have a boys' night one day. And let the kids stay home and watch movies and play games? That would be cool. <laughs>